We are going to begin tonight with Summer's murder. And tomorrow morning, the Spokane woman accused of abusing her stepdaughter to death will plead guilty in Spokane Superior Court. Police say four-year-old Summer Phelps died after weeks of neglect and torture. KXLY 4's Jeff Humphrey live at the courthouse where Adriana Lytle will come face-to-face -face with an unexpected visitor. Jeff? And Robin, that person is Elizabeth Phelps, the biological mother of four-year-old Summer. We talked with her today, and even though she doesn't even have enough money to put more minutes on her cell phone, she is traveling to Spokane from western Washington and will be here in court tomorrow morning. It will be the first time the two mothers have met since Adriana Lytle was arrested in March of 2007. Lytle's charged with homicide by abuse and tomorrow expected to offer the words Summer's biological mom has been waiting to hear. Ms. Lytle has decided that she is going to be pleading guilty as charged. Um, accepting responsibility for her part in this tragedy. Police accuse Adriana and Summer's father, Jonathan, of beating, burning, and even using a shock collar to discipline the four-year-old. Collectively, the abuse inside this Monroe Street apartment led to pneumonia and internal bleeding that claimed Summer's life. A defense witness for Adriana expected to offer an explanation for her assaultive behavior. Dr. Jorgensen uh, will, will uh, tell the court that the only way she knew how to parent uh, a child was with uh, corporal punishment and things of that nature. and was, She just didn't really know what she was doing. She was kind of living off old tapes from her childhood. However, Adriana also wants Summer's mom to know that she did not commit those crimes alone. We will be uh, presenting evidence that will show that, that Adriana was abused to a great degree while she was growing up and therefore had no parenting skills herself and got involved with someone who was not a nice guy either. And that is while well. Jonathan Lytle is still scheduled to stand trial here in October. After her guilty plea tomorrow, Adriana Lytle faces a minimum of 20 years in prison, but prosecutors are seeking an exceptional sentence in this case. Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.